Hi, my name is João Pedro, he is Rafael. Our project is audio processing system based on Zinc SOC. A codec on the board is taking care of recording and playing audio signal and the data is processed both by FPGA and our processor. This is our project block diagram. First, the audio codec takes the data from the microphone. Then, it communicates with the Zinc via I2C. The Zinc can perform four different functions using both FPGA and an ARM processor. It also uses serial communication to communicate with the Raspberry Pi 2 that controls a 7-inch installed screen that is used as user interface. Now we're going to show you a demo of the system that we built. The main controller is a Zinc SOC based Z board. The audio in on board is connected to a microphone and the audio out is connected to speakers. The system also consists of a graphical user interface which is based on a Raspberry Pi with a touch screen. The communication between the Raspberry Pi and the Z board is made through serial interface. The graphical user interface allows us to select between data streaming, adding noise and filtering the signal, performing fast Fourier transform, and um, FIR filtering. The system can also record and play back audio in a certain amount of time. First, we are going to select the noise function. We are able to add noise to the audio. So for example, we choose this frequency. And then we added noise to the signal. Um, this button enables the LMS filter on FPGA, which is capable of filtering the signal away. So as you can see, uh, there's no noise anymore. Uh, we can also record and play back the audio. So as we click on the record button. We can record an audio, so one, two, three, test. And then we can play back the audio as we click on the play button. We can record an audio, so one, two, three, test. In order to display streaming, FFT, and FIR filtering, we need the software on the computer called Serial Oscilloscope. Now we are going to show FFT, FIR filtering, and the streaming functions. We are using a serial oscilloscope open source software. So first, we need to select the function that we want at the terminal. So this is streaming. One, two, three, testing, testing, one, two, This is FFT. And this is FIR filter. Now, going back to filtering, FIR and FFT functions are both executed over a sample of the audio recorded by the Z-board. 